a relic from the early days of space exploration, is making headlines. Not for what it accomplished, but for what it didn't. A failed Soviet spacecraft, launched over half a century ago, is tumbling back toward Earth. And no one knows exactly where it will land. Cosmos 482 was launched by the Soviet Union in 1972 as part of their ambitious Venera program, an era where the Soviets weren't chasing the moon, but Venus. While the US focused on planting boots on the moon, the USSR was quietly making robotic history. Soviet landers became the only machines ever to survive the crushing pressure and blistering heat on Venus's surface. But Cosmos 482 never got that far. Its upper stage malfunctioned, stranding the lander in a looping Earth orbit. Now, after 53 years, its heavily armoured descent capsule, built to survive Venus, is about to re-enter Earth's atmosphere. The re-entry could impact anywhere in some of the most populated regions of the world. The odds of injury are low, but the capsule's 1,100-pound satellite will likely survive re-entry, given it was designed to survive Venus. So, yes, a chunk of Cold War hardware may soon crash somewhere on Earth. Keep watching the skies. History may be falling from it. 